Hey everyone, welcome to another episode where we share your great ideas. That makes our job a lot easier, right? So this time we're going to share some of our favorite kitchen mods and accessories for your teardrop trailer. So my favorite kitchen accessory, saves me space in the tiny fridge, is my condiment tower. <laughs> so these all go interchange and you can take them off and the bottom stays liquid tight. And I guess they're for baby food and mothers put these in their day packs, but it's called in a baby or in a baby. Saves a whole section of the rest of the fridge. <laughs> Fits right in the door. Hi, I'm Kathy, and one of my favorite kitchen accessories is this OXO dish drainer, but it also serves to protect the cover of our stove, which we worry about something crashing down upon it and breaking the glass. And my other thing that I really like are these uh, ice cube makers. They make spherical ice cubes, and they store really easily in our freezer and don't take up much room, but much better than ice cube trays. So some of my one of my favorite kitchen accessories is uh, just going out to a, a Home Depot or any of the stores and getting a little plastic organizer that you might put uh, nuts and bolts in. And I would never really buy a whole jar of mayonnaise when I'm traveling. So these little packets you can get at convenience stores along the way, and then you stick them in here. And the way I've got them is they uh, they help to keep things from rattling around, and they fit perfect for my use. Okay, so one of my favorite galley items are these little stainless steel containers. I got this one from the dealership when I got my camper, and when I was out at a Menards one day, I saw these, and I was like, oh, that's just like the one I got. So I can put uh, granola or things like that in these, and they fit very nicely and naturally in the, uh, this particular shelf in the tag, and then I just uh, put other things in there to keep them from shifting around, but I just love them. So in my TAP 320, my favorite kitchen tip is that I took a little regular um, cutting board and put feet on the bottom so that it can stay in the sink and it gives me more counter space. And my next favorite kitchen accessory or kitchen idea is to use backpacking food because it's so lightweight and so easy to cook and store. So it just makes great camp food. Okay, and our favorite kitchen accessory is to protect one of our prized possessions in the camper. That is the maker of the coffee. So this is a Keurig holder that we got from Amazon, and it's a, a club case, and it holds the, uh, the the smaller Keurig with some room for a couple different coffees, and it keeps our uh, precious cargo safe and sound until our next uh, destination. So my tip for your camping trailer is to dilute your Dawn or whatever you use with 50% water and put it in a pump bottle and it comes out in a foam instead with no waste. Really easy. Hi Mandy, I just wanted to show you a few things that I thought would be beneficial to the boondockers without power. Meats, everybody knows that you can't store meat very well and so i found this company in lima ohio and these are the best meats i have ever had ground beef chicken beef they have pork um, it's wonderful stuff and then for the person that's trying to conserve power and gas i've got a solar uh, called a sun kettle. It basically uses the sun to heat water and cook food. If you want to wash your face, you've got hot water. Um, if you want to cook some hot dogs or some bagged up omelets, you can stick them in the top. They go in the top, which you have to unscrew the first time. But anyway, um, and they fit into the top. And when you have everything all heated up and ready to go and you're backpacking out or you're moving out there it is all put away nice and convenient my favorite kitchen accessory is this wonderful little garbage can this is on amazon 
And what you do is you just take the market bag and hook it around this. But then I added this little plastic bag because that way you can take your coffee grounds and anything that's wet and it perfectly fits underneath the sink. And then I got this on Amazon for my dish towel. And then I also put in this lovely little succulent hanger because I just happen to love greens and it just brightens it up. One of my favorite cooking appliances or apparatuses is this fold and go Coleman fold and go cooking stove. It's real small but it's still real efficient and it comes in with a griddle, regular grill grate and a burner and it is one of the things that we use all the time. It's one of the great things we have. A couple of my favorite kitchen accessories are first uh, the Hot Logic here. Um, it allows me to reheat foods, make my favorite chili cheese dip, and it just plugs in. I love it. Uh, second, I have what I've done is taken some of the netting, like this on the door here, and I've put it up under the cabinet to hold my onions and things that were always in the way on the counter. I just slip them in there, and that's it. Some of our favorite uh, kitchen accessories are the ones that fold up because they take so much less room. And then they store easily. We have two sizes of bowl. This is very handy. We do a lot of pasta so we don't have to carry a uh, colander for that. We've got this. A nice collapsible sink. And uh, this, this is handy because it also, if we want to leave it up, it fits right in the sink. Uh, our, our handy dandy kitchen accessory is actually very easy for anybody. We have an ice maker and you never know where to put the shovel. You don't put it in here otherwise it'll be underneath your ice cubes or you leave it on the table somewhere in the kitchen. So we literally just took the shovel that they give you, I drilled a hole in it, real rocket science, and I put a command hook on the side of the ice maker. Voila, you know where your shovel is all the time. Hopefully you found some of those ideas intriguing and they have inspired you to make some delicious meals in your teardrop camping adventures. As always, if you're interested in any of these items, it really helps us out if you click on the links in the description below. So here's to making delicious food on your camping adventures. Love and light.